Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien at TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day on the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, what if you think about, you bring about whatever you hope, focus on, grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF, folks. Let's make it a great one. Cultivate wisdom. You don't need to accumulate knowledge to become wise. Anyone can become wise. When you become wise, you respect your body, you respect your mind, and you respect your soul. When you become wise, your life is controlled by your heart, not your head. Make it wise! Let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrial's up 704, NASDAQ up 300, S&P's up 98, gold contract flat, 1829 an ounce. You get silver up 12 cents, 21 dollars, 21 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up three bucks, trading at 107.43. Notes and bonds, a 10 year note right now, trading at a, at a price point. Sorry about that, folks. 10 year note trading at a price down 11 ticks at 117.10. 30 year up a full point plus two ticks at 131.01 and King Dollar. King Dollar's down 225 ticks trading at 104.207. Euro 105, yen 135.26. And the British pound at 122 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877 927 6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, you get a bounce going. You get a contraction of volume going. You're coming into the July 4th week, next week. Bottom line, I suspect we're going to run right probably up into July 4th. And what you have here is this. So the spies got 58 million shares today. You're up $9.80. And I suspect this is going to, you know, go probably more than likely go far the bottom of the first gap. Now, the, fir the first gap here is set up at 401.44. And right now, you're at 387.87. We go to the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX 100. What do you have in the NDX 100? Same type of setup. Bottom line, NDX 100 right now up 780. You have 39 million shares. Uh, no, oops. yeah, we have 39 million shares traded right now. Uh, that's going to be a huge contraction also. We did 57 yesterday. Uh, that being said, I suspect this is going to run up into the 299, right now at 292. Now, if you've never seen how the three-gap play works, folks, okay, these are pretty cool, man. Um, I've traded these a lot. So the way a three-gap three play goes is that we had three gaps on the way down, and this is going up to fill them. The way, the first way that the gaps go is the trend. That is basically how it works. So it's going to be really intriguing when we get up into this price point. Um, you know, bottom line, we'll see how it uh, shakes out. I would like to see it into this price point, not until basically uh, July 5th. That's, that's the bottom line. We'll see how this shakes out. But I suspect they're going to get filled, number one, and number two, that you're going to have a contraction of volume all the way up. Gold. Gold contract came out, re rejected lower price again today. We got down to a price point of uh, 18.17. Uh, bottom line right now, it's saying, okay, I don't want to be at 18.17. And that was a fast gap down. I, said, I suspect you trade the futures. A lot of folks definitely get tapped out on that one because the bottom line, it was a, a one minute wonder that uh, took place at uh, basically nine o'clock this morning. Uh, it went from a price point of uh, 8.23 to 8.17 and was back to uh, 8.26 literally in a minute. So it is what it is. King Dollar, what do we have with King Dollar? Well, King Dollar it basically gave the uh, market a little relief out here today. You're down 215 ticks. That being said, you know, bottom line, this is actually a sh uh, sideways move in King Dollar. That's what you have out here. Let's go take a look at some of the higher volume equities. Is this will? So what will end up happening is this. The yeah, volume should come in. We'll, we have a rebalancing in the small caps today at, at, at uh, 4 o'clock. So the small caps are going to have explosion of volume. We'll see what it, what it does to the S&P uh, and to the NASDAQ. Right now, you have uh, Advanced Micro is up $4. You got, uh, let's see, NVIDIA is up 6 and a half. You got uh, Wells Fargo up 2, two and a half. Tesla is up 26. Let's get inside the uh, Dow Industrials and take a look at where the strength lies. I suspect they're almost all green. You know, the only one red is Verizon and United Health. 
So we take a look at point-wise what you have out here inside the Dow Industrials. You get you Goldman Sachs is putting 102 points. You get uh, Salesforce putting 78, Boeing 40, 48, uh, Visa 47. Uh, United Health's the only one really taking 59 points away from it. We go into the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX. What do you have with the NDX? You get Airbnb up 8.4%. Uh, Facebook is up 5.8%, and you got Workday up 5.6%. Uh, taken away from it, uh, you got Lucid down uh, 1%. And other than that, man, you are off to the races because that's very unusual when you actually take a look at uh, something like that. Let's go to Freeport Mac Moran for a couple of the Tigers, FCX. And to take a look at Freeport Mac Moran, um, you know, we'll see whether they can get a bounce out of here. Uh, I don't think this, uh, well, let's, let me see. Well, it's, Freeport came down hard. You're gonna have volume, 138 million versus 106. Well, if you can get this, if we can get this rejection of uh, $29.97 by the end of today, you might have something. It's close, man, it's a close call. Cause this is a lot of volume, uh, the way this came down. There's no doubt about it, let me just see. That swing had 125, 114, 106. Yeah, this is not good. Okay, so here, this is good. This is an ABC structure down. You got $51. This is not good. Yeah, 33, 17, 18 bucks. You got uh, 43, 33, 23. That's 26 bucks, man. Where's 26 bucks? Yeah, I'd be really careful with Freeport Mac Moran. Because what you have here is that we definitely broke this B point this week, and on the weekly, it's going to have higher volume. It needed volume more than 125 million, and we got, oh, no, 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 okay. We don't have it. That's good. One second. Now we get 106 million. Oh, yeah, but no, you know what? It's a four day work week. We do. This is an ABC structure down. Because you take it, you're at 125, bottom line, you already get 106. You add 25 to that, that's 126 versus 125. So, uh, I'd be careful with that, that's for sure. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading up uh, 691. You get the NASDAQ up 292. You get the S&Ps up uh, 96. That is a percentage move, folks, but you have 2.2% in the Dow Industrials, 2.5 in the NASDAQ, and 2.5 in the S&P. Stay right there, folks. Best of Tom O'Brien, we'll come right back.